Adventure works to our SSMS Microsoft SQL Server. Here I just want you to know that Adventure works 2000. First, you have to figure out your SQL Server year. Mine is 2019. If you have some other year, please download the compatible file for your server so i have 2019 server so i'm going to download 2019 file if you are working on data warehouse on olap olap then you have to download data warehouse file according to matching to your server's year so i'm going to download this 2019 back file i'm going to click here it will download in my download file so now i'm going to open my ssms that is sql server and then connect to my SQL Microsoft SQL Server and then I will go to database first I will click connect and then I will go to database this is my database I'm going to click restore database and from there I'm going to click device and I'm going to click three dots I am going to download from the, my local disk so i have file there are other option also url and all but right now i'm going to show how to this is your default please you have to copy your default and then go to your file paste and click enter so this file is empty this is since this is my default place I'm going to go to my download copy this file again go to this is the place default place show more paste I'm going to paste my stuff here for i'm going to repeat the steps for you to remember i copied this went to here and typed that and went to downloads because server does not have access to my download file this is the file my server have access so now i'm going to go here here is the thing I have to go to program files from program files where is my my SQL server see my SQL server from there I have to go to MS SQL 16 area this uh, everything you have to go step by step then I have to go to backup see backup and from backup backup as soon as I click on backup my this thing comes up so uh, I have a long path so you have to figure out the long path you have to go on searching okay this is MSCL and, and then click and then click step by step you have to go sometimes you have short path some path sometimes you have long path that's okay you have to figure it out step by step from here here I have I'm going to put add and okay and okay I'm going to click so here is the thing see it is showing from here everything details of uh, my file adventure works component is database full copy only so adventure works position one checkpoint all this so click OK restored successfully so this is my 
thing has been connected so I click refresh I'm going to click it's expanding so here I see adventure works T 2019 so let me see see I have tables expanding my tables so this is the tables I have worked with this uh, database many times so I know the table so here's how this should look now I'm going to go to new query so as soon as I go to new query I have to find here see this was in master if I had clicked anything here it would not have worked I have to click to my site that is very important if you have if you are in master and you type a query it will not answer so first you have to click and see where you are so right now I'm in adventures work LT 2019 now the query will work observe this so now I'm going to put a query s e l e c t select star select star I'm going to type from now let me see which I'm going to type okay I'm going to type sales wait 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 okay here s e a l e s sales l t dot b product category i think this is the product category is yes, product category okay it's not a So now I click the executor, execute the, uh, now you see the tables all. I have 41 rows in this. This is how you connect your SQL to the database. Today I have worked with AdventureWorks T2019. You can uh, connect your database to the SQL server this way. Thank you for watching. If you like my video, 